Okay, so we're on Hash Mountain in the Swan Range, uh, about 7,000 feet on East Aspect. Um, we're along a ridge line, and we actually camp here. Uh, we wanted to check the reactivity of the recent wind slabs, and we were sort of surprised at this elevation and this close to the ridge to find not one but two layers of uh, buried surface hoar in the top foot of the snowpack. Um, so we've got our January 19th rain crust, and then about five centimeters below that, there's a layer of preserved surface hoar. Um, again, that's just about a foot from the surface. And then about six inches from the surface, there's another layer. Um, we've done a couple of stability tests. Neither of these layers <clears throat> are especially reactive, and partially due to the fact that we don't have a very cohesive slab on top of them. Um, but over the next couple of days, it will be important to watch these layers, pay attention to the fact that these weak layers exist. Uh, warming temperatures help to form a slab. Uh, additional wind and additional snow uh, could cause these layers to become more reactive.